Hello and welcome to this video. Today I want to talk about why embedded systems or embedded software engineer is a great career choice. But before we do that, let me first introduce myself. My name is Florian, I'm a computer science professor and I've been working with embedded systems most of my professional career. And of course, at the end of this video, I will also tell you why I choose this as my career. Why do I think embedded systems is a great career opportunity, a great career choice? Before we talk about this, let's first talk about what does an embedded systems engineer or an embedded software engineer actually do and what an embedded system is. An embedded system is a system that's comprising hardware, software, sometimes even the mechanical parts of it and the software is embedded into the hardware. So there's a very close relationship between software and hardware. It's not like software that's running on a PC where the software doesn't know necessarily on what hardware it's running, but it's quite the opposite. The software is very close to the hardware. It has sometimes direct access to the hardware, requires direct access to the hardware. And that's what we are calling an embedded system. And embedded systems nowadays are really everywhere. Whether we talk about a coffee machine or software in a car, in an airplane, in a train, in a camera. So wherever we have microcontrollers or microprocessors, we usually would talk of an embedded systems. And with Internet of Things becoming more and more popular and more and more devices being connected with each other and to the World Wide Web, there's even more embedded systems surrounding us. And that's already one of the first pros of the embedded systems or embedded software career. There are a lot of opportunities out there. The opportunities really range from automotive, aerospace, medical systems, consumer electronics, and more and more and more systems that are out there need to be developed and companies providing embedded jobs. The second thing that makes embedded systems quite interesting is that it's sort of in the middle between computer science and electrical engineering. You have to know both. You have to know the ins and outs of computer science, of software engineering, programming and things like that. But you also have to have an understanding of electrical engineering and how electrical systems work. And only if you have both you are successful at building embedded systems. And that's what's making this very interesting on the one hand. And on the other hand, there are not a lot of people that actually have both skills. And that's why if you study already something like embedded systems where you have both topics and you're trained on both topics, that's even better. But of course, if you have only studied computer science like I did, you can still learn the electrical engineering portion either on your own or taking courses at the university or taking courses somewhere else and then become an embedded engineer. Similarly, if you are an electrical engineering student and you want to learn software side of things, that's also possible to do as well. So the pros are there are a lot of systems that need embedded systems know-how. It's a really interesting job where you deal with both the software and hardware aspects of the system. But for me, what's really important and making this really interesting is you are always working on real systems. You can touch your system, you can interact with your system. And trust me, I've been developing smartphone apps, I've been developing websites. That's also something that brings a lot of joy and that I like doing. But it's also a very nice feeling if you walk around the city, for instance, and you see 
cars around you where you know, oh, inside this car there is a system that I developed, there is my software driving around and you can show this. Or when you see an airplane that you have been part of the development team or um, you see a medical device or w whatever it might be, it's really nice to have something that you can touch, that you can show rather than just something entirely digital. Is it a career choice that I would recommend for everyone? Well, no, because you really have to like what you're doing and you have to have fun at it. Otherwise, you will not be successful. That's for all jobs the same. So only if you really like hardware, if you like electronics and software engineering, then embedded systems is a good career choice. If you are more focused on electronics only or on software engineering only, but don't want to really go that deep and that close to the hardware, that's fine. Then embedded systems is not for you. Now I'm of course interested. Are you already in the embedded systems field? Do you already work with embedded systems? How did you end up working with embedded systems or what's motivating you? What's exciting you to work with embedded systems? Write it down in the comments below. And of course, if you found this video helpful, then please leave a thumbs up or a comment below. And if you want to see more videos just like this one, then please subscribe to my channel so that I can see you in the next video.